my, my, my four years, the skill boost has been uh, very high on this team. We have a lot of guys. We got KP, 6'4", just as fast as me. We got Ah, we got um, Shalik Nas. We have a lot of guys that can go. Braden Wislowski. So we have a very talented room. So it's, also, it's just us about put, keep putting in that work and being ready for the season when the season comes. Obviously, there's a quarterback battle. But you guys probably have the confidence in each and every one of them no matter who the single college team. Yeah, 100%. Uh, those guys have been putting a lot of the work. They've been watching Talia play for the last three, four years. Having a quarterback of that caliber, watching him play, you know exactly what to do to be as great or even better than him. So it's very, it's definitely a blessing seeing how hard, how hard uh, those guys work. Can you talk about the expectations of this team coming off successful last season? Uh, it's a sense of urgency because we know we can do it. We know we can compete with everybody. So it's definitely a sense of urgency. Uh, it's our job as leaders, such as guys like me, KP, Dante Trey, to lead by example on and off the field for those guys. So we plan on going through the season, focusing on one game at a time. But our, our goal is to win every game. So we go, we, uh, yeah, so that's what I'm saying. Mike said that this is going to be a different team than previous teams. How much different is this team? Uh, we're a very uh, player-led team, so that's the culture we've been trying to create ever since I've been here. So we're a very player-led team. We hold everybody accountable, so uh, uh, I would just say that. He also said that he wants you guys to dream big. Do you like him when you coach Yeah, 100%. Uh, that's why we practice and we go so hard every day. Uh, our goal is to win every game no matter what, so that's why we practice and we play so hard. So uh, dream big, that's definitely uh, uh, something we're definitely doing right now and just having the confidence, so 100%. You were recently selected to the Shrine Bowl watch list. How important is it for you to kind of take it one thing at a time, like you said, and not look too far into the future? Yeah, I'm, I'm in camp right now, so my, I'm only focused on the season. I mean, it's definitely a blessing, and I'm very thankful for them uh, looking at me as one of the top guys in the country. So it's definitely a blessing, but I'm all focused on the season in camp, and then I'll worry about that stuff after when that stuff comes. Hey, Ty. Billy, uh, you've worked with Billy before, but you've got a lot of new guys in that quarterback room. H having been with Leah for three years, are there things you, as a wide receiver, that you'd like your quarterback to be able to do or, or in terms of delivering a ball that you kind of work with the newer guys saying, hey, on this route, maybe place it here, place it there type of thing. Do you, do you get into that much detail with those guys or you let them kind of develop and, and figure it out along the way? Uh, I'll say a little bit of both because every quarterback, they like certain things and stuff. Every receiver likes certain things. But in the day, uh, the quarterback is the leader of the team. So I'm, I'm catering to the quarterback. Whatever he wants, that's what I'm going to do because he, he's the leader of our team and we all lean on him. So I just say uh, just kind of watch and film together, getting in practice, extra practice reps after practice, getting the weekend reps. So all that all that helps for sure. So. And it feels like uh, almost – same expectations of striving for a Big Ten championship. It almost feels like a little bit of a blank slate as well. You guys can maybe play uh, kind of more free out there. Uh, and it, to me, it seems like you still have a lot to, to show people that maybe, you know, have seen what you can do, but I think you still got even a higher ceiling to hit. How much more determined are you to do that this season? Yeah, that's been my goal. My whole mentality this season is just being, 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 being uh, very dominant. I come, coming in, uh, I had a torn ACL in high school, so I, I hadn't really played in two years, so I kind of had to like learn how to be that guy again. So this year, my confidence at an all-time high from the work I put in as well. So I definitely feel ready this season, and the whole team is ready to go this season. And the final question for me, it feels it's crazy. It feels